I wish you a very, very happy Valentine's weekend. I pray that it is a time that you reflect on God's love that is everywhere present. And I also ask that you reflect on God's love for you, that perhaps you can make yourself a Valentine. You can treat yourself as God would want you to be treated. I'm going to share some poetry today that has meant a lot to me over the years. It's by James Dillett Freeman, uh, a friend of mine in the past, and it is called Love's Omniscience. He says, Sometimes I think little I know me. I am the unexplored. For the most part, I stand, as it were, on the edge of a wide sea, and the sea I gaze upon is my own heart. For I have other dimensions, and I am more than I have judged. I was from surface seen. This face, this body, these are but the shore. How far beyond them stretch my seas of being. I have thought I was an island, a rocky shelf of separateness. But the eternal deep forever breaks across the reefs of self in me and over me and through me sweep the seas of God and often now I sense that I am one with God's love omniscience. When you realize that every day you are literally surrounded, enfolded, baptized, submerged in God's love, that you cannot be separate from it, that you're not a lonely, isolated island out there all alone, that you are supported, you're uplifted, and you are honored by God. It changes things. It changes you and it empowers you, not just to love yourself, but also to love others. As you overflow with God's love, it will overflow onto other people. And I pray that it begins this Valentine's weekend. I pray it's a special time for you in every way. Happy Valentine's Day.